Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be trying a new type of video and I'm going to be creating my dog Millie in The Sims 4. But I'm not going to be creating her as a dog. I'm going to be creating Millie as a sim. And I've actually never seen anybody do this before and I don't fully know how I'm going to do this. But we're going to kind of go with the look of how Millie looks. I will show you a photo of her and we're going to bring that on over to The Sims and create a female Millie. I guess. I hope that you enjoy this video. Let me know if you'd like me to try something like this again. If you do enjoy it, don't forget to give it a like and let me know what you think in the comments and hit that subscribe button for more. Okay, so this is our starting sim. So we're going to go with Millie Baby. <laughs> that is Millie's name. And okay, Millie's voice. Right, we're going to make her a young adult. She would actually be an elder considering oh, she What's is el nearly 11. She'll be 11 in June. And for every one human year it's seven dog years so she's gonna be 77 which is wild so she would be an elder but i'm gonna create her as a young adult and i think she would have quite like a soft soft kind of sing-songy voice actually not low it would definitely be high maybe something like that she would have a cheerful walk is there like a cheerful walk a perky walk i would definitely say millie would have she walks like that as a dog that'll be what she's like in the sims her aspiration would i feel like she could be a serial romantic in the sense where she just wants to give love but uh, she also does like her foodies she loves nature as well and being outside in the woods so maybe we do something <laughs> like outdoor enthusiast let's do outdoor enthusiast she loves her little walkies so we'll do outdoor enthusiast and her traits would be she's not active she hmm what would little millie be she's not a foodie she can sometimes like food sometimes go off it i wouldn't say foodie let's give her lo loves the outdoors trait since we're going with that for the aspiration i would say she probably loves the outdoors i would say she could be a bit of a snob like uh, like oh i'm better than you like looking down on you kind of thing I'm gonna do snob for now for Millie. And I would say she's quite family oriented. Yeah, let's do family oriented as her final trait. Oh. And okay, this is our little starting sim. So let's have a little look at you. Let's take everything off. I would say this would somewhat be, you know, Millie's sort of size. She is not a big dog i mean she's she's very small she's tiny she's petite she's quite a little skinny thing so i'd say the sim that has come in here is a pretty pretty decent size for for little baby millie i think i will use some of my obscurus eye presets she's got big like round eyes maybe we do obscurus number seven and then kind of like mold it how we want it to. it's got kind of rounded eyes like i don't want her to look like a cartoon character though Maybe we do kind of something like that. And Millie's got big brown eyes. So let's do these cute little brown eyes. A little side profile. Now, Shih Tzus have a very kind of flat nose. So I would definitely say she's going to be more kind of on this side of things, as flat as possible. Let's do these brows. And I think I'm just going to arch them down a little bit. And if we jump over to skin details, actually, let's do skin tone. She... Her fur is like a golden skin tone. So maybe we do like a golden sort of colour. Something like this perhaps would work. Um, very sun-kissed maybe. And I think she would look quite cute. Rather than looking kind of older, I think she'd have very kind of a cutesy look to her. So I think the Go Pulls Me overlay face skin V1 would probably work. I've actually used this on my Sims and Bloom characters and it gives them that really cute little vibe and I really like it. And I want to try the kind of downwards lashes, like something like this maybe. I think that's really sweet. Millie's got really long lashes as well. I feel like they're kind of perfect. Normally I would go for one sort of like this. But with Millie's, I feel like this makes more sense because her lashes do kind of come down like that. Um, so I think that's really beautiful, actually. Could definitely see her as the freckle type. Maybe freckles like those. A little bit of blush. We'll get a little nose shine on her. I think she's really, really cute. The kind of skin poor, realistic poor face thing by GS. I actually don't know who makes that, but it is really good. We'll do an obscurous little nose mask. Very kind of button nose, which I think is very Millie. She's got a really cute little button nose. 
Okay, I think that's her skin details done. And if we go into tattoos, I'm just going to pop a eye highlight on that, I think. Maybe if we do that one. And she, her fur is very kind of like golden blonde. So that's what we're going to be looking for when it comes to her hair. Kind of, it's straight, but it can be curly. So I, I'm going to say wavy. So we're looking at potentially something maybe like this. That's actually very sort of Millie-ish. Perhaps like this sort of hairstyle, although I don't know if that's too sort of straight. But I mean, she suits it. This kind of vibe could work. Or this. That's kind of cute. This would be a bit too curly, I think. And I don't know if the colour would really match her fur. This is very pretty. But again, the colour swatches aren't too vast. This is a wings hair. So I don't really know if they'll have... I mean, that could match. I don't fully know if some of them will have the colour swatches to kind of match. With this, I like it but I don't like the way it kind of covers half of her face, like half her eyes. That's very pretty. That could work in maybe that swatch. Or you've got this one kind of all pulled over to one side. Ooh. This is kind of nice, but again, not really the color swatches that we are looking for here. I think, hmm, I think let's go for this Nightcrawler hair and then we'll do a cute little hair accessory as well. And how would she dress? I think she'd dress quite cosy. Millie loves to kind of just lay on the sofa and sleep and spend all day like on the sofa. So I'm thinking kind of cosy vibes for her. Okay, so this is the first look that we could go for her. As I say, very comfy, cottage, cosy sort of vibes. We could also do something like this as well, which I feel suits her also. Very kind of girl next door vibes, still very cute. I love this little skirt as well. I think it really the colours really complement with her hair as well and um, with her brown eyes. You could also do some like light pink. I don't know why, but I always she's got a pink collar. Maybe that's why I'm going very like pinky, neutrally kind of colours. Because she's got like a pink collar, pink lead, pink a lot of things. So let's do a pink outfit. Let's try like a girly pink outfit for her, I think. Maybe something like that with like a little crop top kind of vibe. I've also put this little bangle kind of wrist bracelets on her as well. And also this cute little CC ring as well. And this is her third look. Let me know which out of the three was your favourite. I'm also actually just going to put some makeup on her. I do feel like she would be so quite light on her makeup. So like very kind of light amount of eyeshadow. Maybe like the smallest little bit of liner like that. And then just like the smallest amount of lip gloss or something that's not too in your face. There we go. Just this little lip gloss. Is that too much? I feel like that's too much. Okay, there we go. Pink, but a little bit toned down. Let me know what you think of Baby Millie in the comment section below. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a cheeky thumbs up and hit that subscribe button if you want to see more of my Sims videos over here on YouTube. And if you want to follow me on my Twitch and see live streams five days a week, I will leave that down in the description below as well. But I hope you enjoyed today's video. Take care, look after yourselves, and I will see you in the next one. Taz out.